Hi, I'm Bethany Frankel, and I'd like to share with you some of my recent experiences in disaster relief. I met with Delivering Good, I think, a less than a week before I went to Puerto Rico. I, I think they're still in shock right now because when I told them I'm gonna get things done really quickly, I don't think that they knew what they were getting themselves into. So I live in Dorado, Puerto Rico, and we are not getting supplies. I'm from Corozal, Puerto Rico, and they have forgotten about the center of the island. That's why we're walking, we have to walk for everything. Oh my God. Yes. But we, but we have life right there. But you have life? We have life. We're alive. What's your name? Gloria Cruz. Gloria Cruz. I'm going to help you right now. And I needed a partner that was respected, had experience, was legitimate, was powerful, had financial capability and an infrastructure. I'm Lisa Gerwich, the president and CEO of Delivering Good. I'm in Houston today as we provide over $5 million of new product to those in need in Houston. Anytime. Thank you so very much. Thank you, Houston. Houston Strong. Um, tell us what the first night of the storm was like for you. Horrified. Three days before then, I had just came home from getting my leg amputated. So I was scared that, that, that I could get, if it could get wet, I might not be able to get out. I was scared. When it became morning and the water had rose all the way up to the uh, box spring of the mattress, it was time to go. To see all of this come together, to, I've just unloaded a 53 foot trailer with 15,000 pounds of product. I'm looking around and saying, wow, this all came off that trailer. We helped facilitate getting these goods here. And all these people are working here as volunteers. It's an amazing feeling. It puts a smile on my face and a tear in my eye. Uh, it was kind of crazy, you know, we lost everything during the storm, but it actually brought us closer together. The gift cards are gonna be used for school clothes, clothes for the kids, shoes, <laughs> and you know, whatever they want. Thanks, Bethany. Be strong. Well, you could tell them from me, their project definitely have been a success. Definitely. Because without it, we wouldn't have nothing. And a lot of other people wouldn't. We need to continue to create a sense of urgency for those here in the Houston area, in Florida, in Puerto Rico, in the islands, plus those facing the challenges of poverty every single day. In 2016, Delivering Good helped approximately 2.5 million people across the United States. Delivering Good provides new merchandise and essential supplies, helping families in need pay for necessities like food, rent, and medical expenses. I can't help but to be more motivated and inspired to use my platform to voice what a great organization has done to not turn their backs on women and children that have been incarcerated before. It makes me feel powerful standing in front of people with the kind of clothes that I would not normally be able to afford with two kids and the kind of income that I make and full-time student, so it's amazing. So when you get a new outfit, how does it make you feel? Because I know how you feel, so tell me how does it make, make you? It makes me feel great because I'm, I get to try out new clothes and wear new clothes. It makes me feel great because I get to um, have something new to put on. I'm most proud of my mom because uh, she takes care of us and she loves us a lot. Oh, I love you guys too. Mm. Mm. Uh, there's really no end to people who need our help and we're there to provide it.